So we made the peeling in, guys. Only took us like an hour and a half, two hours, something like that. So we're looking around now. See all the cool stuff that's here. What you can expect when you come to the peanut park. It's a food truck. Oh, these little gnats are terrible here. Look at ice cream truck. The beast. Guys, mini donuts. All right, mini melts. Like it's like a mini thing. That's cool. Mini, 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 mini. Oh yeah, this is what we're here for. This is the pizza resistance, people. This is what we've been training for. Corn dogs. And of course, the main attraction, peanuts. I'm not even lying. It's three dollars a cup, and you can refill for two fifty. There's a four cup family for ten dollars. Apparently, they've been doing this for 35 years. And I've seen some other information, some other peanut party type things. Let's see, the peanuts, oh, here we go. 1983, the peanut party program. Peleon farmers have been producing and harvesting peanuts for over 100 years. For years, after the peanuts were gathered, the main social event of the fall was a peanut boil at homes in the community. And so now they turned it into this. That's interesting, they have like, you know, winners for Let's see, scholarship winners. They have a bunch of food eating stuff. They have a peanut butter and jelly food eating contest <laughs> here, but that's on Saturday and we're here on Friday. So it costs you a dollar to enter and you get $25 if you win. So they had a bunch of music. It's just a cool little, like, very chill thing to do. Sort of like an oyster roast downtown Charleston. So tell me, man. 
how are your peanuts? They're pretty good. They're pretty good? I usually like them a little bit saltier. Yeah, these. I haven't had any in a while, so they're, they're, they're doing pretty good. These taste really fresh, guys. Really clean. Like, you know, the only time I've ever had boiled peanuts is from a gas station. So to get them sort of freshly done is a, it's a little bit different flavor. They are salty, but they're not super salty, and they taste like really clean. If that makes sense. They're really locally grown, so yeah, they're not yeah. shipped in from somewhere by a molten bag with yeah. pesticides and stuff. Yeah, exactly. exactly. So definitely worth it if you're a boiled peanut lover to come down here. Not very crowded, that's what we like about it. Kind of noisy though, we don't know what's going on. But that's it sounds the, like... Uh, that's the, uh, the, uh, mon the uh, monster truck. Oh, that's the, the monster track. truck that, that you saw little, earlier, that's okay. A, that's the um, ride for the little track. Okay, cool. All right. So after this, we're thinking about going to downtown Pelion, right? Okay, and then we're gonna go over there and see what's hopping down there. Probably not much, but we want to go see anyway. Um, yeah, that's it for now. We'll see you over there, guys. All right, guys, we had our peanuts and we're done now. So downtown looks like the thing. The only thing we would say that maybe is sort of bad about this is the gnats. So bring a fan or something because. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere. And they really, really love your ears for some reason, so just be aware of that. All right, so we're headed downtown. I think we're actually gonna go look at something over there behind me where the, well, the, they have like a little mini carnival rides for kids. So I might do something over there, but after that, it's definitely downtown Pelion. Okay. So this is the Pelion Town Hall, and what's really cool about it, other than it being really small, you know, Pelion's so small, they really only need one building, and it's not even open all the time, is this cool caboose. Now, my husband and I have used this before as just like a picture backdrop. It is, I guess you would say, a reminder of what put Pelion on the map for so long. They're peanuts and the train. They have other train-related things around, but they're really small. So this is just really cool. If you ever want to get something, a picture or something that is not typical, turn around here so you can see me. It's not something everybody else has. This is a good way to do that. So Pelion, South Carolina, you're tiny, but you're cool. And we'll probably be back to get our pictures on the caboose. All right, guys, next time.